Hi, I'm Andy Shaughnessy for iConnect 007 here at Productronica at the Nordson Asymtech booth. And here with me is Camille Seibert. How are you doing, Camille? I'm doing well. How are you? Good. Uh, Camille is the product marketing engineer for uh, Nordson Asymtech. And uh, Camille, why don't you tell us about this uh, conformal coding line? Sure. So we'll start out first by talking about Nordson Asymtech. And we've been big in conformal coding, especially in Europe, for a while. We really specialize in closely processed controls, selectivity, and innovative developments. And we have one of those innovative developments right here. We have a line concept showing a lot of synergy going on between our Yes Tech, our Norton Yes Tech inspection system, and our conformal coding system. Uh, so, like I said, we've always been big with closed loop process controls, and we're taking that one step further with Industry 4.0 initiatives. So, if we're talking about the aspect of social machines and how machines communicate, we're taking advantage of our Norton umbrella and bringing in our inspection system which is featuring a dual top and bottom side um, inspection and it's also taking thickness measurements of your conformal coating as well. Mm -hmm. And for the communication aspect, the thickness measurement is something that gets logged and traced over time, something mm -hmm. that's also really important with Industry 4.0. So as trends start to develop and you notice changes in thickness, the feedback from the inspection system goes into the conformal coding system and will eventually be able to make adjustments mm -hmm. in the programming to maintain a consistent thickness mm -hmm. over the course of your process. Mm -hmm. So again, feeding back into that closed loop process control. Mm -hmm. uh, in general, we have a very, very modular concept right here. So we're starting out our line with the lifter, then we have our inspection system, a conveyor, mm -hmm. we feed into our 940 conformal coding platform and we go into another lifter and then what happens is after this lifter the board comes in goes through a return conveyor and comes out the other side one advantage of the system is that the return conveyor in this concept doubles as an IR oven so it really saves you a lot of process space uh, so we have a couple videos over here in our, our Lego blocks that show that really you can take a much larger line concept and really double up on your technology and save a lot of space. Uh, we also have, from our selectivity standpoint, uh, we have certain advantages over here. We have our triple applicator set up. Uh, we're highlighting our conformal coating jet and our uh, film coat applicator, our SC280, which has been very well used mm -hmm. in uh, Europe. And we also have other developments as far as selectivity as well. Mm -hmm. On the other side of the booth, we have our latest spray applicator, our SC350, mm -hmm. uh, which for a spray applicator has really excellent edge definition. Mm -hmm. That system over there is also featuring a two component conformal coating feed system. And uh, the applicator is on a, a tilt and rotate, giving mm -hmm. additional accessibility and flexibility to our customers. And once it's done with that system, it also feeds into a UV LED oven. Okay. Um, I, I think it's really interesting how the one machine is learning from the other machine and learning to measure and getting kind of almost like uh, almost like AI sort of over time. Right. right. So part of Part of the advantage of this is that our, our customers are able to get real-time feedback. So we're also showing CPK measurements as well. So the system is able to track and maintain the conformal coding machine's accuracy over time. Um, and again, we have that thickness measurement mm -hmm. uh, and calibration adjustment as well. Mm -hmm. um, and all of this also goes with the FIS and MES systems that we've been installing at our customer sites for years to really make sure that they have that full process knowledge and traceability that they need. All right, it's, uh, it lo looks like a winner. It's uh, great stuff. And, uh, and uh, I know we'll, we'll be back uh, talking to you soon, I'm sure. So. Right. Sounds good. All right, thanks. Thanks for talking to us. Again, here at the Nordson Simtech booth, I'm Andy Shaughnessy. Thanks for watching.